was insane. What's up, my name is Steve, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about the Aura Ring 2. Is it worth it? And uh, what are the most significant benefits that I've noticed from, from using it? One ring to rule them all. One ring to find them. One ring to bring them all. And in the darkness, find them. This is the One Ring. Okay, for those of you who haven't heard of it, then uh, the Aura Ring is this cutting-edge sleep-tracking uh, device that is gonna measure how much time do you spend in different sleep stages. So this is the first generation ring that's been out for a few years. As you can see, it's quite hefty and uh, looks pretty cool. And this is the second generation ring that is uh, recently just came out. And as you can see, it's much smaller. And uh, you know, they, you can feel the weight difference as well. And this is the black one. This is a prototype that I got to use before the actual release. But essentially, uh, I've, I've been using this one for over a year. And I must say that it is, it is indeed one of those things that I find incredibly invaluable because it's going to tell you exactly like how much time do you spend in different sleep stages, how, how fast have you recovered from the previous night, what's your heart rate during the night, what's your core temperature, what's your heart rate variability, how fast do you fall asleep, how efficient was it, and... You know, it's like a magic device in, in terms of actually getting some quantifiable data about what you do during the night, how much time do you, how many times do you wake up and uh, things like that. It's quite cool. This is something that you wouldn't be able to, you know, get based on your intuition of, oh, I feel that I've slept pretty good tonight, but in reality, when you look at the data, then uh, you might have, you know, woken up five times and you barely got any REM sleep. Technology is very useful in actually gaining some insight into what your, you know, human mind can't actually perceive uh, quantifiably. So in my opinion, like, you should, if you want to optimize your sleep and take it to the next level to, you know, be really healthy in the long term, then you want to, want to have something that is going to tell you what's your progress like or, you know, what's your actual status in terms of your sleep. And, uh, yeah, now the second ring... Uh, is also quite useful and uh, I would say that you know it's more accurate and uh, it's gonna be more effective in, in the data that you receive. They've done some actual studies as well with actual sleep labs where they compare uh, the Aura Ring with like a proper sleep lab with you know all the gear around you and uh, they found that the Aura Ring gives you as accurate data as the Sleep Lab. So the Aura Ring is one of the best commercially available sleep tracking devices. And uh, I think it's for habitual use for the ordinary person. It's like a perfect thing. You don't even notice it when you're wearing it. And it looks kind of cool. But you know, the second ring, the second ring is even more undetectable. If you compare the Aura Ring with like... Uh, a regular ring, then you barely notice the difference. Uh, this is like the actual one ring. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> but yeah, if you were, were to use it, then uh, yeah, it's perfectly similar. Biggest mover of sleep as far as getting healthy and better sleep is consistency. If you can get to bed according to what your chronotype would dictate and we help you find that by looking at your past sleep data if you're consistent with when you go to bed and when you wake up that is going to give you the highest quality sleep day after day after day now the second gen aura ring has had some troubles with its launch and uh, they've uh, had some hiccups <laughs> so to say some people have actually been quite mad about it like i ordered my ring like eight months ago and i haven't received it what's up the ring must be destroyed. And yeah, true. the truth is that uh, they've, they've, they've been quite slow with uh, shipping out the pre-orders and uh, things like that. And there's been uh, quite a long uh, waiting time for, for them. But, you know, part of it has to do with probably the huge demand for these things. Because Aura has become quite popular uh, over, the, over the past few years. 
and I think like they simply weren't ready for such a influx of new people wanted to get their hands on this uh, this thing and of course people like Prince Harry using the aura ring aren't aren't making it any better they're only gonna popularize it even further it doesn't matter what kind of performance you want to optimize whether that be business performance physical mental performance whatever it is you still need to sleep because sleep is the most important uh, variable that is going to de determine your you know, cognitive functioning and how you feel during the day. And that is also one of the reasons why I think like compared to the price that you have to pay for it, which is like $300, it's like nothing compared to the amount of value you get from it. Like I would have to, I would love to play for like 10 times more for this thing because I think like it is worth it. I will take the ring to Mordor. So in terms of like the batteries, then this is the old one, this is the new one. As you can see, it's again much smaller, much more compacted and uh, more energy efficient. Uh, to char This old ring lasts for about three days, whereas this one can last for over a week and the charging of both of them is also quite uh, fast you can charge up the entire ring in less than an hour and it's gonna last you a long time usually when I do use the ring then uh, I'm gonna look at the amount of hours I spent in deep and REM sleep because those are the those are more valuable in terms of like the quality of sleep and uh, yeah, that, that's a good indicator of how well I slept and how prepared I am for the coming day. If my physical preparedness and readiness is low, I didn't get enough good sleep, then I'm not gonna hit hard. I'm not gonna hit myself hard at the gym and I'm gonna take it easier because my body isn't ready for that. My nervous system hasn't recovered. So that's another example of an invaluable uh, aspect of self quantification it can also measure your daily steps so you don't have to be using those fitbit trackers specifically you can still get all of them in the aura ring and one of the best things about this is that uh, you can turn it on airplane mode so you, you you're gonna avoid all the emf all the bluetooth signaling as well and uh, that's why i think the aura ring is the best sleep tracking device because uh you don't have to sleep with Bluetooth around you and you're not gonna put, you know, you're, you're gonna wear this ring and you're gonna keep it on your heart or something during the night. You can, you're not gonna radiate your organs like your brain or something. It's, it's on airplane mode and it's gonna collect the data while being offline. So it's perfectly safe and it's not gonna disrupt your sleep or anything. It's because of men the ring survives. Now, of course, there are some cons to these technological devices. They're not going to be 100% accurate all the time. They may get buggy sometimes. The cloud app doesn't sync properly. But overall, those things are somewhat rare. And uh, they're not going to be that big of an issue. Unless you're planning on getting like a real sleep lab into your bedroom that's going to detect every little movement you make and uh, every little shift in consciousness, then I think the aura ring is your best bet and it's incredibly cost efficient so if you are interested in getting yourself one of these awesome sleep tracking rings then um, head over to orarink.com and use the code seamlund you're gonna get a 50 dollar discount and uh, it's gonna be quite quite a huge bargain in, in terms of the actual price to get yourself the one ring of sleep tracking other than that, thanks for watching. Click the like, subscribe, and notification bell as well. My name is Seam. Stay optimized, stay empowered. The ring yearns above all else to return to the hand of its master.